Hello everyone. Welcome to today's webinar on marketing and PR opportunities for WCM London 2016. My name is Paul Nelson. I look after the press and PR for the WCM portfolio and I will be your host for today. So as I said, today's webinar will focus on marketing and PR opportunities available at the event, which I'm sure you all know takes place between the 7th and the 9th of November this year. So the webinar will look at new initiatives, my invitations, press packs, the official WTM publications, amongst many topics. So today's webinar is obviously predominantly targeted at marketing and PR teams. So any individuals who are involved in promoting your organization for WTM London. So before I move on to the agenda, I just wanted to remind you all that you can send questions in any point during the webinar and we have a team of people working in the background to answer those questions. Those questions that resonate the most, we will then uh, bring up as part of the webinar to make sure that everybody listening has the answer. So, it will be speaking, as I said, I will be the moderator today and I am joined by three able colleagues, Nicole, Annabelle and Emily, all from the PR and marketing team here at WTM London. So here's the agenda for today's webinar. We'll kick off with those all important key deadlines, then move on to my invitations, then the targeted email service, then we'll look at marketing tools, PR opportunities, the question and answer segment that I mentioned on the previous slide. We'll then review the whole webinar with a top tip section, and then we will look at the future webinars that we will be running for you. So all the information we go through today will be available on demand for your view. But please do concentrate on what is being said as all the presentation slides will be sent to you tomorrow. So on your screen we have the key dates and deadlines that you need to be aware of. First up is the 18th of September. That's the deadline for the badge price discount. So if you want to order badges above your free allocation, then make sure you do this before the 18th of September to take advantage of that discount. Next up is the 23rd of September. So here you can gain free access to the targeted email service and invite all your contacts to WTM London. Again, from the 23rd of September, you'll be able to download your e-badges. And then finally on the screen, you can see there the 10th of October is the deadline to submit your media diary of events form. All of these can be done via the WTM exhibitor portal. So I now pass you over to my colleague, Nicole, who will talk you through the process of my invitations. Thanks, Paul, and hello, everyone. So I will run through my invitations with you. So firstly, what is my invitations? Well, my invitations is an initiative which enhances the exhibiting experience by giving you, the exhibitor, the opportunity to invite key clients and buyers to attend the event. This invitation is for all three days of the show, with only those invited having access to Monday. This means that by inviting your contacts, you'll be giving them exclusive access to all three days of the show. Another reason that we advise making the most of this service is that we offer free access for up to 1,000 names of registered visitors, visitors from the WTM Visitor Database through our targeted email service, which we will talk you through, through a, bit more, a bit later on. We will allow you to send as many invitations as you wish through the system. However, in order to receive the free access to 1,000 names, you are required to send a minimum of 250 invitations. Please note that you can still upload as many names as possible even after the deadline. As previously mentioned, the tool is available to all exhibitors through the exhibitor portal and it sits alongside the exhibiting badging section. Contacts can be added to the database in two ways. First of all, it can be added through a single upload where you simply enter the contact information of your invitee into a form or through a multiple upload where you can upload an Excel spreadsheet to the system. Once the contacts are added onto the system, an email invitation can be sent to them at any time up until the day before the show at the click of a button. You can send all invites at once rather than it being a manual process. This means that once you upload multiple contacts, an email to all invites will be sent automatically in one go without having to tick the boxes and pressing send in batches. We encourage that you send your invitation emails as soon as possible. 
This will ensure that your clients will receive their invitation well in advance of the event, allowing as much time as possible to make travel and visa arrangements. In order to get free access to the 1,000 names, as I mentioned earlier, in the WTM Visitor Database, you have to send a minimum of 250 invitations, unless you are a, top, a tabletop stand. If you are requiring assistance in uploading or sending your invites, please contact our customer service team on wtm.helpline at readexpo.co.uk. Please note, by uploading your data to the invite system, you are not sharing it with anyone else other than WTM London. No one else will have access to your data. I will now pass you over to Annabelle, who will explain the targeted email service that we offer. Thanks, Nicole. Hello, everybody. So the targeted email service is a free service for exhibitors who have submitted the minimum allocation of MyWTM London invitations by 23rd of September. When you qualify by sending your minimum number of invitations, you will be able to gain access to and contact up to 1,000 pre-registered visitors directly from the WTM London Visitor Database for free. You may purchase more than 1,000 records, but will be charged for these at £1 per record, plus that. So how can you use this tool? Once again, this is accessed through the Exhibitor Portal from a tab called Targeted Email Service. Once accessed, there is a search feature which allows you to identify the types of contacts you wish to email. You can search by geographical region and product interest of the visitor as well as industry sectors they are from. Once you are happy with your selection, you can choose how many contacts you will email at one time. A default email of invitation will be presented which can only be sent through the system. Your personalised email will include your SAN number and an editable free text box where you can highlight your services and offers during WTM London. The big difference this year is that you will be able to see the job title, company name and country of all the contacts and if you would like to exclude any individuals. You can deselect them before sending the email. It really is a great way to raise awareness of your business in the build-up to WTM London. I will now pass you to Emily, who will take you through my event. Hello, everyone. My event is a platform to help you organise your WTM London experience. We will notify you by email when it's live. Use this tool to enhance not only your company, but even yourself. The system allows each individual staff to have their own profile on my event, which will help to increase your company visibility even further. Every member of staff registered in the portal for a badge Will automatically be sent a username and password to access my event through the WTM London website. So why use my event? The system has five key features which are easily search con and connect with visitors attending the exhibition, contact important buyers by using the inbuilt messaging service, arrange meetings with your key contacts and potential new business partners, browse through the WTM London event program, view and select your favourite speakers and seminars. Manage your diary for the entire exhibition using this one platform. New, and new for 2016, my event will also provide you with a number of recommendations. These recommendations will list the number of buyers and visitor profiles based on their preferences expressed at the point of registration. These will be matched according to what you may have specified when creating your profile. The match will be based on product interest, main company activity and geographic regions that your com company operates in. Make sure you hold all the vital event information in the palm of your hand by downloading the WTM London mobile app. The app will be available to download in October from both the Apple and Android stores and has been designed to allow you to have all the information of the show on your phone. It includes the complete exhibitor listing, including your profile in buyer's pockets, your My Event diary, in-app direct messaging, an interactive floor plan with networking opportunities, access to your e-badge, a full seminar guide, WTM London's social media feed, and general information on WTM London, the venue and the surrounding area. This year, the app will be synchronised with my event, so any meetings you have arranged, any messages you may have sent, and your favourite conferences and seminars will all be accessed, accessed through the app, making it a truly on-the-go tool. I will now pass you back to Paul. Thank you, Emily. I'm now going to talk you through the official publications for WTM this year. So as you can see on your screen, we have the WTM London preview, which obviously takes place before the event. Then during the event, we've got three key publications. The first one, WTM Business, then the WTM London catalogue, 
and then the WTM London route planner. And then finally, for after WTM, we have the WTM London review. So these are a great opportunity for exhibitors who are obviously all competing for attention during the event, before and after the event as well, to provide a unique opportunity to uh, promote what they are looking to talk about at WTM and what they are looking to sell to buyers and promote to exhibitors. So as I said, it's a great way to showcase your organisation and product to the entire WTM audience before, during and after the event. This can help to increase visitor traffic to the stands, strengthen brand and product awareness, and significantly improve new business opportunities. So as you can see from what I've outlined, there's a variety of promotional print and digital options available throughout the WTM publications, giving great flexibility and creativity for exhibitors to reach all visitors and participants. And there are a number of different bespoke marketing campaigns that we can put together to suit needs of all exhibitors. So you can see there, it's run by EPS Publications. The gentleman in charge is Alex David. And there are the contact details on the screen should anyone be interested in having a chat with him to see what is on offer. So the final key official publication that we run at WTM London is the WTM dailies. So these are daily news magazines that are out every morning of the event. And for this year, we'll have an online edition which will go sent to everyone's email on the Thursday, so the day after the event closes on the Wednesday. As you can see on the screen, this is run by our UK media partner, Travel Trade Gazette. And the publications are called TTG at WTM. There's a couple of examples there of two of the front pages from last year. So these are really key magazines. They're given to all of the visitors as they come in through registration. So they're very good opportunities, again, to get your message out, talk about your brand exposure, and promote those key uh, products or uh, that you're looking to promote while at World Travel Market London. So, from the end of September, the 26th of September, there will be a submissions form on the TTG website which you can fill in with your key stories so the TTG editorial team can then decide whether it warrants a place in one of the four publications. As well as that, you can also submit it to an email address and the email address is wtm at ttgmedia.com. And new for this year, we have the WTM Responsible Tourism Yearbook. World Travel Market London 2016 will commemorate two key responsible tourism anniversaries. The first is it 20 years since the, effectively the birth of responsible tourism and 10 years of World Responsible Tourism Days held at World Travel Market London. So to mark this occasion, GT Media ME Limited will publish a high-end bespoke publication called the WTM Responsible Tourism Yearbook. So it's an inaugural edition which we will look to run every year from now on. If you're interested in taking part and advertising and issuing uh, editorial options for this, then please con use the contact details on the screen. As you can see, the booking deadline is 12th of October and the artwork deadline is a week later on the 18th. So now that's that, and I'm going to pass you back to my colleague Nicole. So I'm going to talk you through the Media Diary of Events. Um, this is a great opportunity for you if you have any events or any hospitality um, receptions that you plan to hold on your stand during WTM. So the popular pocket size um, booklet, WTM, Lead WTM London Media Diary of Events, details all the key activities and events in a day-by-day -day format and is given to all the attending journalists during the show. So if you are planning anything, whether it be a press conference, new product, service, a launch or you're staging a hospitality event or hosting a celebrity, then please submit your media diary of events form um, by the 7th of October. We also have a team of great photographers on site who are walking around on the show floor capturing all the best bits. So if you do have any events that are going on, then please do let us know so we can make sure that we send one of our great photographers down there to capture it. We have hundreds of high quality images available for all the press to download on the picture library. 
There's also a section for exhibitor library for the exhibitor library, so you can go in and up, upload your own pictures and share them with journalists, publications, and tourism sites um, back at home. If you're interested in doing this, then we can send you some very clear instructions after today's webinar. Um, and also for this year, we have some very exciting news. For the first time ever, we'll be holding our press centre right on the exhibition sh show floor. So we're really looking forward to having that buzzing hub in the middle of all the action. And we have around 3,000 journalists attending from around the world, and this is made up of print, media, radio, TV broadcasters, photographers and bloggers. And that's a mixture of consumer and trade press with about a 40-60 split. It is in fact the largest recurring press centre in the UK. Um, so now I'm just going to hand you back over to Annabelle. Another free initiative is our WTM interview wall. Excellent opportunity to bring along your key spokesperson. Slots are given based on editorial merit, so make sure whoever you bring along to the wall has an interesting story to tell and is brief to be viewed about it. All the interviews are listed in the WTM Media Diary of Events. Invite your media contacts along as well. We have a WGM cameraman based there throughout the day filming all the interviews. They're then hosted on our YouTube channel. The wall will be located in the press centre, which is in the new location on the show floor. As highlighted here, you won't be able to miss it. It creates a great buzz. If a few journalists are there, then it's the prime location for other members of the press to get involved. Slots are available from September onwards. Contact us if you're interested in featuring on the wall. I will now be taking you through the WTM London Radio. At WTM, we have two radio booths for exhibitors to conduct both live and pre-recorded interviews with radio stations. This, again, is a free opportunity. We pitch stories into radio stations to, in the build-up to WTM, so it's important that we know what your plans and key messages are. Last year, there was almost 300 pieces of coverage for exhibitors throughout the four days of WTM, totaling more than 13 hours of airtime, with a PR value of more than 1.3 million. If you want to be heard on radio, here are some top tips on what works well. An interesting theme, so a story angle that presenters and in turn radio listeners will find enjoyable and memorable. A good spokesperson slash celebrity, Radio presenters are more accommodating if we have access to celebrities, brand ambassadors, or independent travel experts. A time hook, so an anniversary or a birthday always appeals to radio presenters as it provides a reason why the topic slash subject is being covered at that particular time. And also research. Independently commissioned research adds weight to a campaign and allows us to create the story when a time hook is not evident. During the show, we're open at 8 a.m., which is two hours earlier than the exhibition itself, on all three days to ensure press can get ahead of the game. During WTM, please bring your press packs to the WTM Press Centre either Sunday afternoon during the build-up or a Monday morning. The press wrecking area can be found in the WTM Press Centre, which, as mentioned, will this year be located on the exhibition floor in the South Hall. The wrecking area will be organised regionally to make it easy for press to find what they're looking for. Please make sure the information in your press pack is current and most relevant, including press releases, contact details and media resources, such as photos and videos. We accept hard copy press packs and CDs and USBs. Make sure you connect with us via social media. Not only is it a great way to stay up to date with minute-by-minute -minute news and activities at WTM London, but it also increases your exposure to all our followers. This slide shows you all the social media channels that are available to you depending on your preference. Also see at the bottom are Paul and Natalia's contact details for anything um, PR related we've spoken about today. So just to recap on a few of the top tips from today's webinar. First up, make sure you send your invitations out, as many as you like. Take advantage of the targeted email service that we've got available through the Exhibitor Portal. Log on and update your Exhibitor profile on the Exhibitor Portal. Prepare your press packs ready for the Sunday before WTM or the Monday morning. Connect with us on social media platforms and make sure you take advantage of the WTM London interview wall and book your slots from September. Our next and final webinar takes place on Wednesday the 12th of October where we'll focus on networking and lead generation. So a really good opportunity there for you to listen in and see how you can make the most of being at WTM and meet the best buyers. Topics will include further details on my event, information on the WTM London app, 
information on WTM Buyers Be Networking events, scanners that you can hire for, the, for your time at the show, and more information on the WTM London floor plan. Right, well I'm really pleased to say we've had loads of questions come through while we've been doing the webinar. And just a quick reminder that the team in the background will continue to answer any questions that you have for the next 10 minutes or so once the webinar is finished. So uh, here's the first question. It says, if I have an event for press, how can I advertise it for free? I'll pass that one over to my colleague Nicole to answer. So we have the WTM Media Diary of Events booklet, which I spoke about earlier, and it's free to post your event in there. Look out for the form online in September. It'll be in the exhibitor portal. So you can complete the form, and then your event will be included. Included, And then it also goes online so that all the journalists can look online before they attend WTM and plan their time accordingly. Great. Thanks, Nicole. I've got another question here, which I'll pass your way as it's press-related. Uh, can we contact media through the targeted email service? Yes, you sure can. Uh, press contacts will be included in the database and you'll be able to search and select for them and send them a default message as you would any other visitor. Great, thanks Nicole. Uh, Annabelle, another question here regarding the targeted email service and the question reads, who are the records that I'm collecting on the targeted email service? Uh, these are pre-registered visitors directly from WTM London Visitor Database. As mentioned, this can be segmented to meet your individual needs. Great. Thanks very much, Annabelle. And a question just regarding deadlines. Uh, it's been asked, uh, where can I go on the website to find all the deadlines? Emily? Um, so if you go to the Exhibit tab at the top of the home page and then scroll down to Exhibitor Planner, you can find all the essential deadlines you need in there. Great. Thanks, Emily. And another one for you, Nicole, regarding my event. How do I get my my event login? So every member of staff registered in the portal um, for a badge will automatically be sent a username and a password to access my event. Um, and then you can access that through the WTM London website. Great. Thanks for that, Nicole. Uh, one here for you, Annabelle, regarding staff badges. How much is it to buy additional badges for staff? Uh, so the price is £20 before the 18th of September, and then after that it's £25. Great, thanks very much there. And then one final question. Uh, it says, where can I submit, or when even, can I submit the story for consideration for the WTM at TTG daily publications? So there will be a form, as I said, on the website from Monday the 26th of September, and there's also an email address, wtm at ttgmedia.com. Right, well that's it for today. Uh, thank you all very much for your time. I hope that you found this webinar both enjoyable and informative. As I said on the previous slide, if you have any questions that you want answered, then please do continue to uh, send them in as we will have a team of people who will carry on answering them for the next 10 minutes or so. Further on from that, and, and once that's finished, if you have any further questions for our customer service department, then their email is there on the screen at the moment. So thanks again, and we all look forward to welcoming you to the networking and lead generation webinar that we will hold in October. Registration for this is now live on our website. Thanks again, and look forward to speaking to you soon.